hello in this tutorial we are going to talk about method of detail estimate so there are two methods one is called as a long and short wall method and another is called as center line method okay so we'll talk about both of these methods right now and in next tutorial we'll start long and short wall method okay so what is long and short wall method for calculating quantity of various construction items long wall and short wall method is used okay for measuring the long wall and short wall the external this is the point okay out to out length of the wall is considered as long wall what out to out length of the wall is considered as long wall while in to in or internal length of the wall is called as short wall so let me just give you the example over here let's suppose we have just this one room plan and the internal dimension is 6 meter by 4 meter now if i considered this dimension or dimension of this wall as out to out okay or if i measure this wall as out to out this will be considered as long wall while okay these two walls are same so we will take these walls as long walls because we are measuring these two walls as out to out from this position up till this position so this will be considered as long wall and you can see the total length as internal length is 6 meter and we need to just add the thickness from this side and this side to reach up till this level and this will be considered as what long wall okay and a end to end dimension will be considered as what short wall so if we measure this wall from here because we have measured already this wall up till this position okay this wall and we'll we have take this wall as a long wall now we have to just measure this wall automatically as in twin okay so this will be considered as short wall these two walls will be considered as short wall so if you measure any of the wall as out to out okay that will be called as long wall and if you take any of the wall as in to in dimension that will be called as short wall okay let me just uh, give you uh, the example again over here let's suppose if i take this wall now if i take this wall as out to out dimension this will be considered as long wall now you can see here maybe you will be confused but here you can see we have total internal length of this wall is 4 meter and we need to just add thickness from this side to this side to reach up till this level okay from here to here now this will be let's suppose this is total of 4.6 meter okay including this thickness and if we measure this wall okay so it is 6 meter in to in so here in this case uh, we can say it as that this dimension is less this is larger okay and uh, we can say it as this is long wall and this is short wall but this is not the case uh, if we take any of the wall where the dimension is what okay out of dimension that will be considered as long wall so in this case this 4.6 meter wall is a long wall and this internal dimension as 6 meter this will be considered as a short wall okay so hope you understand right now what is short wall and what is long wall again i'll say over here if you take any of the wall as out to out dimension that will be considered as long wall okay like this and if you take in to in dimension of any of the walls that will be considered as short wall now hope you understand the concept behind the long wall and the short wall now the next thing over here is the center line method second a method is called as center line method and in this method first calculate the center line length okay so here in this case we have to just calculate the center line length of all of the walls let's suppose this the internal dimension of this wall this is 6 meter now we need to just add half thickness of this wall and half thickness of this wall to reach to the center okay from here to here now same in this case we have total of 4 meters so we need to just add half thickness at this and half thickness at this to reach at this level so we can just specify the center of this wall and we can specify the center of this wall okay now after doing this 
uh, we have to just multiply it with breadth and the depth of the wall okay to find out the total quantity so these are uh, two method one is uh, called as a long wall short wall and another is called as center line method in detail estimate case okay now in next tutorial we'll start from the long long wall and the short wall and we'll do some of the example regarding long wall and the short wall and next we'll do the example regarding the center line method hope you really understand the session we'll see you in the next